Ya, saludo a Dinamarca, a todos los chilenos que estén por allá viéndome. Soy la famosa Andrea. Hey, Kike, do you love me? She said, I only love the beach. I'm a mama, I'm sorry. Welcome to Iquique, here in Chile. I'm on my way down to Santiago, which is another day's travel from Iquique, all the way down south into the middle of Chile. Iquique is here in the north of Chile. Iquique, as you can see behind me here, is a harbor city. One of the most important ports or harbors of all Chile. This city, Iquique, is known for being an import and export city. A city where people come from all over the world to set up businesses because this is what they call a Zona Franca. Located just around the corner here, over there, behind the naval base, is a massive shopping center where people, as I say, come from Peru, from Bolivia, from Japan, from China, historically, to set up businesses, do import and export with massive container ships like this one. So right here at the harbor, we've got this big fish market here. Well, behind us here, these guys are coming in. All their fishing boats are here in the mornings selling fish to the local people as well as in the fish market. And one of these guys over here just dropped a whole bucket of fish intestines down here. But we have all the sea lions having an absolute feast on all, on all the fish. Check it, check it out. Absolute carnage here as he drops in a bucket of fish intestines. We've got the pelicans, we've got the sea lions all fighting for fish and intestines. They are massive. Look at them fighting and everything over the bites. Some of them have bite marks on them as well. Now, I suggest we're going to go and find a similar type feast. Check it out here. Here they're selling all these fish. What are these? Tuna or something? Oh no. ¿Qué, ¿Qué pescado es? Mono. Pescado mono. Ah, parece como atún. Parecido a atún. Oh, okay. Feliosa sus dientes. ¿A cuánto vende así un.? Los tres, así un. Tres por cinco mil. Ok. Y todos los mañanas la gente venga acá, los pescadores. ¿Y qué tan lejos se van para pescar de eso? 10 minutos, 15 minutos. 10 minutos adentro. Y pesca mucho. ¿Salmón hay igual? ¿no? Aquí no. Más azul o como. Ah, ok. ¿Y qué recomiendas comer aquí? Arriba. Voy a comer algo. Es caro. ¿Es caro? ¿Pero qué es el, el plato más recomendado? Bacora, más que nada. ¿Bacora? Albacora. Albacora. Pez espada. ¿Cómo? Pez espada. Pez espada. Ah, con el... con este... long... el, el nariz, con un sword. Espada, ok. ¿A cuánto vale eso? Cinco mil. Vale, gracias. Chao, chao. <laughs> so, swordfish. Or albacora is what this guy is recommending me to try. Here we have the whole fish market up there. He's saying it's a bit expensive. Well, yeah. Let's go ahead and check it out. I see a stairs up the way here into the market itself. So over there, you can obviously come and buy fresh supplies if you live here and have, have uh, a lunch that you want to prepare or dinner. But I'm just gonna try a dish. Obviously fishing is one of the big industries here in Iquique. So let's go, see what we can find of interesting food before we head into the center of town. Uh -huh. El señor de abajo me dijo albacora o pez espada. Uh -huh. Albacora tenemos. Albacora. Sí. Albacora la tenemos en sándwich uh -huh. y la tenemos también en plato. Tiene con tres agregados. Puede ser papa frita, papa mayo, arroz o chilena. 
Pap ¿Qué son estos tipos de papas? ¿Papa frita o no. papa al horno? Papa mayo es papa cocida con mayonesa y cilantro. Ok, como tipo ensalada de papa. Ajá, eso. ¿A la plancha es mejor que frito o frito mejor? A la plancha. A la plancha. A la plancha. Ya saca más sabor. El pescado suelta el sabor. A la plancha. A la bandeja. Ok. ¿Y cuánto vale? 10 mil. El plato grande. 10 mil. Ok. Eh, sí, probamos uno. Sí, sí, sí. Por favor. ¿Cualquiera de esos? Los rojos es el tuyo. Ok, gracias. ¿Qué hay? ¿Qué probamos? Hay juguitos naturales, tengo tecito de hoja, cafecito. ¿Cerveza? También. Ok. Tengo Heineken. ¿Qué es la cerveza de acá? Cristal. Cristal, de aquí de Chile. De Chile. Este es Eso. Ok. ¿Cómo es su nombre? Daniela. Daniela. ¿Y quién es esto? ¿Alguien más o está usted solito? Solo. Solo. ¿Es mucho para uno? No, está bien. Ah, ok. Es mayo casera con mayo ajo y Ajá. este es pebre. Pebre. Con, ah, como ají picante. Con zanahoria picante. Ok. Sí. Lleva Excelente. de todo pancito y uh -huh. ahí le vamos a traer la cerveza para servirse. ¿ya? Perfecto. Gracias. Muchas gracias. Ok, so we ordered this albacora. I have no real idea of what type of fish it is, whether it's a white fish or a dense fish or a red fish like a salmon. But we will try. So yeah, we're gonna get a lovely brunch, fish brunch, and then we're gonna head into center afterwards and explore the center of Iquique. Let's go, let's wait for the food here and for the beer. We're gonna test the Chilean beer. Now that we have come to a new country, we always have to taste the local beer, the local beverage. So let's go, wait for the food. Beers have arrived, this crystal thing, Cristal. I did not know I was getting a beer that's 1.2 liters. That is crazy. I certainly won't leave, the, leave this lunch thirsty for sure. <laughs> Let's try. Let's serve ourselves a bit of beer and give it a go. See what it's like. Salud. All right, basic beer. Nothing special. Tastes a bit like um, like a Heineken, just your normal classic lager that every country has. All right, so food has arrived. Check it out here. So we have this fish albacora here. It does seem quite dense, like almost like a tuna type density. Then we have this potato salad thing that they called Papa Mayo. So it was mayonnaise and potatoes and cilantro, coriander. And then we've got the Chilean salad, onions and tomatoes and more coriander. As you can tell, I am a big fan of coriander or cilantro. Now, this looks amazing. This looks very dense. It's not swordfish, but it kind of looks density wise similar to saltfish or tuna let's try oh yeah and with like garlic butter it's on on the what you call it on the grill with uh, with garlic butter and a couple of and some italian herbs ah, tell you what that is beautiful let's try this mayo potato salad thing here as well cold cold mayo potato salad with cilantro very solid i think that will be nice with a bit of this spicy sauce here now chile's best spicy sauce ¿Qué es el nombre de ese salsa picante ¿Cómo? Pebere. Pebere. Es uh, así, listo. Que le echa cebolla, ajo, tomate, el ají, uh -huh. eh, sal, uh -huh. ají no moto, aceite. Uh -huh. Pebere. Pebere. Entonces, si digo pebere en cualquier lado de Chile, ¿saben qué es? Saben lo que es. Ok, es como el común de Chile. Claro. Ah, ok. So there you have it. That is the... That is the makeup of the of this spicy sauce here in Chile. Let's try with the 
Chilean salads and a bite of fish. Oh yeah. That is delicious. Wow. Wonderful. I will, safe to say, enjoy this brunch here. Brunch lunch thing. Before we will then go into the center of city of town here in Iquique and explore what's up in the center. School. I tell you what, I've eaten a lot of weird stuff, interesting stuff, delicious stuff and not so delicious stuff over the time of making these videos. But this has to be right up there with Lechon as one of the best things I've ever eaten here on these videos. This fish, I'm telling you, is like a piece of beef, basically. There's no bones in it. It's like dense like a piece of red meat. The best description I can get to you is if you've, tr if you've tried either swordfish or tuna, it is basically in that sort of elk of fish. Absolutely delicious. Barely any bones in it. Absolutely, actually no bones whatsoever. Cooked with Italian herbs and garlic oil and garlic butter. What can you go wrong with there? Like, it is just perfection. Wonderful, wonderful. All right. Now, I will finish this food and we'll head into town and explore the rest of Iquique before catching the bus this afternoon headed further down south eventually making our way all the way to Santiago we may have left Bolivia but we still have Bolivian people here Sopa de Mani check that out Sopa de Mani Pique Macho Picante de Pollo Parriada just going to show just what I was saying that this is Hola, ¿cómo estás? Muchos bolivianos acá, ¿no? Sí. Sopa de maní y todo. Es rico la comida. ¿Cómo? Es rico la comida de probar. Sí, sí. Bueno, ya vení de Bolivia para acá, entonces. ¿Sí? Comido mucho sopa de maní. Ah, es muy rico. Hay chicharrón de chancho, pique macho, pique Ajá. de pollo, parrilla de pollo, chuleta. Ah, ok. ¿Tú eres boliviano? Sí. Ah, ya, yeah, ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. Y aquí venden buses para... Ir a Bolivia o cómo? Sí, a Uruguay chama la paz. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Bueno, yo me voy a Santiago hoy. <laughs> sí. sí, sí, sí. Bueno, ten buen día. So there you go. Here's another one who is selling buses to Oruro, bus tickets. Oruro, La Paz, Bolivian destinations. I think uh, this is like this is like a currency exchange. Está llamando a la amiga, la Bibi. ¿Cómo? La Bibi te está llamando. ¿Tu amiga? Sí, ahí está. El TikTok, dijo. Saludos, Daniel. Ah. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Bien. Bien, bien. Charque. 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 ¿Ustedes son bolivianos? Ah, sí. sí. Aquí hay mucho extranjero, ¿eh? Hola. Y ustedes venden tickets, igual, buses ah. para, para volver a Bolivia. Ah, ya, ya, ya. Bueno. Y sopa de maní y todo. Ahí hay sopa de maní, almuerzo. Todo comida boliviana. Vale. Nos vemos. Ten buen día. Chao, chao. So, there's even Bolivians here that have seen the videos. And that sound sounds just like someone from the, from the La Paz bus station screaming Oruro Hola, ¿cómo estás? <laughs> ¿Cómo estás? ¿Qué tal? Muy, muy, mucho gusto. ¿Cómo le va? Igual, muy bien, muy bien. Explorando el Quique. Trabajando, acá trabajamos. ¿Usted es boliviano igual? Peruano, peruano. Peruano, ah, ok. Boliviana, boliviana. Tú boliviana. <laughs> Ten buen día. So Peruvian man as well. A Peruvian man as well. 
selling bus tickets. Hola. ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás? ¿Qué están haciendo? Ah, todo bien, todo bien, todo bien. Tomé de todo un grandes cervezas venden acá. Y es aquí a, abajo en el puerto. Un litro y dos. 1.2 litros. Grande. Un litro y un dólar más. Ese cristal cosa. Bola, cristal es un botellón. Gigante. Sí, sí, sí. Allá en el, en el puerto. Un pescado y. Ha ido al puerto. Ya tomo. Ahí va a ver los ¿Cómo? lobos marinos. ¿Yo? Sí, estaba en Colombia, ¿no? Antes sí estaba en Colombia. <risa> ¿Cómo están? <risa> Bien, bien, bien. Ahí va el puerto de Quique. Ustedes son colombianos. Boliviano. 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 Bolivia, Bolivia. 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 Ecuadoriano. Ah. Por eso digo. Mucho, boli... mucho extranjero en, en todo Iquique, ¿no? De... Aquí veo... de todo. Venezolano, colombiano, Ajá. ecuatoriano. Sí, sí, sí. Hasta veo... Japón. Ahora. Veo Japón, China. No, en eh... eh, eh, la... En el, eh, en el mall. En el puerto. En el puerto. En el puerto y en esa zona franca sí, donde venden sí, cerveza. Sí. Eh, sofri, celulares y todo. Sí, sí, sí. Tecnología. Ya. Y Croacia veo igual. Hay aquí muchos hay, diferentes. Ahí, sí, sí, sí. Árabe. Aquí luego ah, también árabe. Ah, árabe. A turcos igual, sí. La plata. Porque venden, eh, importa, exporta ah, y todo. Ah, ya. Ecuador. Lindo Ecuador. <risa> Similar a Bolivia. Montañas, selva. Selva. Más de todo selva. Y tienen playa y todo. <risa> bueno. Un buen bueno, día. Momento, un gustazo. Buena. Igual, igual. Con... Vuelva, vuelva, que más tarde está más movida. Claro, claro. So this section here seems to be some kind of like you see, they're selling shoes, clothes, stuff like that. Here we've got the sopa de maní, sopa de quinoa, all sorts of Bolivian dishes here. Hola. 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 ¿Cómo están? Bien, gracias. <laughs> Aquí mucho comida boliviana. Mucho comida boliviana. Y peruano igual. Allá. A frente. Sí. Ah, sí, rojo, rojo blanco allá a frente. Sí, pues rojo blanco. Muy bien. Gracias. ¿No va a comer? Justo comí pescado allá en el, en el puerto. Pero aquí le podemos ofrecer sopita de maní, sopita de quino. Sí. Sí, pues no te gusta. Claro, me encanta, ¿Así? pero. Justo estaba comiendo y ya estoy llenísimo. Ah, llenísimo, pues la llevo. Y vení desde Bolivia para acá, entonces mucho sopa de maní comido. ¿Ah, sí? Sí, sí, sí. Bueno, entonces compra y lleva para más tarde. Ah, eso es una idea. Cierto, Antola. <risa> bueno, estoy bien, estoy bien. Gracias. Well, at least she's trying to sell something. She's saying, bring some for later for my bus ride. Okay, we'll head further in. To what? Oh, there's something going on up there. I see something looking like type of a market or something. Can you see that? Let's head up that way. Can you hear that? That sounds even more Bolivian. Some kind of entrada. It's como una entrada. Boliviano, peruano. Ah, aquí. Gracias. There's some kind of like a Bolivian festival type thing. I don't know exactly what's going on, but let's go and see it over here. They're right there. Let's check it out. Check that out. The dancing here. Let's go in and see. Pero eso es más como... 
¿Y qué? A la iglesia a saludar a la Virgen, al Señor y después bailan en el día. ¿Esta iglesia que hay allá? Correcto. Todos los bailes tienen que hacer una entrada para saludar como que vienen llegando. Cuando termina mañana, después de la procesión, tienen que hacer la despedida en la iglesia, despedirse de la Virgen hasta el próximo año. Oh, ok. Gracias. Yeah. Voy a ver allá entonces. Ya, yeah, creo. No. So, some sort of religious parade going on for some kind of virgin and we've got this the the church just right over there this one right there and as you can hear some more people are dancing and playing instruments and all sorts of stuff let's go and see exactly what's going on here it seems like it's inside the church itself Let's go ahead and see what's going on in there. Hola. Oh. <laughs> ¿Sí? algo religioso. Sí, sí. Oh, okay. Es como algo de este Chile, Perú, peruano, boliviano. No, no, no. Chileno, chileno, chileno. 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 Oh, okay. Se celebra nuestra imagen, la nuestra señora del Carmen. De, de aquí. De aquí, de, de Plaza Rica. El Virgen de, 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 de Chile, Chile, de Chile, de Chile. Oh, okay. Sí, ella es la patrona de Chile. Ah, ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. Interesante. Sí. Vale, gracias. Ya. Yeah. So it's some sort of local Chilean celebration for this virgin here, the Virgin of Carmen. Seems like everybody's going into the church now for some sort of celebration. This region, obviously, previously has been, I think, If my history is not mistaken, this region has been Peru and it's very close to Bolivia as well, further down south in the more southern part of northern Chile, if you will, used to be Bolivian. So there's lots of intermixture of inter-exchange of culture here between Bolivian culture, Peruvian culture and Chilean culture, which is obviously why these entradas, these parades here are very, very similar to some of the things we've seen in Bolivia and as you can see like there's another one coming around the corner here we've got these guys standing here with like almost looking like pirates a mixture of flamingo and pirate ¿Qué significa tu costumbre? Los costumbres de acá o costumas la ropa eh, parece pirata lady was saying this signifies saying hello to Jesus and then around the corner where the church is is where they go in and say hello greets to the to the virgin there that was unexpected to find that let's see what else we could find here on an interesting day exploring 
the central parts, the markets, so on and so forth of Iquique. So we've got some kind of market attached to this parade going on today where they obviously as you can see selling mostly clothes which I'm not really on the hunt for I tell you what though I would totally be up for like a juice or something like that fresh pressed orange juice or something like this would be wonderful but as we can see Hugo Hugo no vende no, empanadas pequeño. Ah, okay. Bueno, gracias. She does not sell juices. I'm not really on the hunt for more food. Oh, yeah. I had a lot of food already. <laughs> so, I don't think that dish was massive. Like, with the beer as well. It was humongous. So check it out. Like, got people here. They're also selling ceviche. By the way, in the comments below, ceviche, is it Peruvian or Chilean? Let me know. It's kind of like their little fight between Peru and Chile. Who is the owner or the right father of the ceviche? I see a juice. Some guy selling. Hi. Hola. Hello. Hola. Yeah. Hola. Yeah. De Dinamarca. Dinamarca, ya un saludo a Dinamarca entonces. <laughs> Saludos. Yeah. ¿Y tú de dónde? Yo chilena. 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 Ah, okay. Fírmame. ¿Cómo? Manda, manda un saludo a Dinamarca. Claro. Aquí saludas. Ya saludo a Dinamarca a todos los chilenos que estén por allá viéndome. Soy la famosa Andrea. La famosa Andrea. Sí. Yo el famoso Sebastián. Ay, qué lindo Sebastián. ¿Cómo estás? Bien, cuídese. ¿Cuánto vale el jugo? Un pesito casero. Mil pesos. Uno, por favor. Bolilla y todo. Fresco naranja. Sí, sí, sí. Aprovecho. ¿De dónde eres tú? ¿Chileno? Colombiano. Colombiano. Ah, ok. Estaba en Colombia hace unos meses. En Medellín, en Cartagena, en todos los tipos de lugares. Bogotá y todo eso. ¿Y cuánto? ¿Por qué viniste acá? No, a conocer y uno se queda para conocer. Acá trabajando. Ah, okay. Mil pesitos casero. ¿Eh? Mil pesitos. Sí, ahí échela. Es bueno. Ah, fresh pressed orange juice. Just a thousand pesos. Slightly more than a dollar. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Aquí hay mucho de diferentes países, ¿no? Sí, Colombia, Chile. Croacia, veo. De todos tipos de lugares. Hola, ¿cómo está? ¿Ustedes bolivianos? Let's see where my, my man went. I gave him a 20. A 20,000 bill. Looking for some change. So I'm with our juice. The Colombian man was not the most talkative. But he gave me a wonderful juice, just a thousand pe Chilean pesos, which is slightly more than a dollar. It's like a dollar, 10 cents type thing. I was saying, yeah, unfortunately, this market seems to be more of a just clothing market. Hola. Not much else going on than, than clothing being sold. So we'll head back towards the area where they were doing a parade and see what's going on there see what they're selling over there maybe we can find another little snack or something <laughs> Hola. <laughs> the old lady was fancying a piece of the the Danish Viking so there you have it from the Bolivians themselves there are a ton of Bolivians here in Iquique. But this parade today is not actually a Bolivian parade. It's like a... Hola. ¿Cómo estás? Bien, bien, todo bien, todo bien. ¿De dónde están ustedes? ¿Chilenos? Sí. Ah, ok. ¿Cómo se llama el canal? ¿Cómo se llama? ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo se llama el canal? Pilgar Explorers. Pilgar Explorers. Exacto. 
So this video took a complete other direction than I thought it was going to take. I didn't know there was this, this parade going on today. That was complete by chance. I just got recommended to go and check out that area of town to go and see what was going on there. Because, yeah, I've been told that that, was, that that had a lot of business and so on going on. But yeah, unfortunately, I'm not able to stay around for this for the rest of this parade it seems like a lot of fun because i have to go and catch a catch a bus down south headed towards my way to to santiago today so with that said i think that will be the the end of the video here and i think we can safely conclude that iquique is exactly like this uber driver was saying a very multinational um melting pot of cultures we've seen lots of bolivians peruvians colombians i don't know what else we've seen of nationalities in this video today i've seen i don't know if i've gotten that on the camera but as i said there's a turkish kebab shop there's a croatian consulate here lots of different types of of nationalities congregate in the city of iquique and with that said I think it's time to say again, Ikike, do you love me? I only love my bed and my mama, I'm sorry. See you whenever I see you. <laughs>